Hello my dear students. Today I'm going to teach you English literature the third part of chapter 2 Kaku and Lal Hawa. Then he heard a noise coming from the village. Everyone was running towards Lal Hawa shouting and cheering. Then suddenly he could hear some noises coming from the village. He turned and looked at them. He saw them running towards Lal Hawa. They were shouting, cheering and very happy. And they all were running towards Lal Hawa. He could see his Amma his school teacher, his friends and the old retired railway guard hurrying towards Lal Hawa. So when he saw all the villagers running towards Lal Hawa, he could see his Amma, that means his mother, his school teacher, his friends and the old retired railway guard. So he saw them all running, rushing towards Lal Hawa. Lal Hawa had stopped at Choti Dadi and was waiting to meet Kaku. Now, Lal Hawa had stopped at Choti Dadi and was waiting to meet Kaku. So Kaku had a dream to meet Lal Hawa. So Lal Hawa had stopped at Choti Dadi and waiting to meet Kaku. Lal Hawa whistled aloud and Kaku laughed and whistled back. Quickly, he climbed onto Lal Hawa. So Lal Hawa was waiting for Kaku. So Lal Hawa whistled aloud and Kaku laughed. Now Kaku was very happy. Okay, so Kaku whistled back to Lal Hawa. Quickly, Kaku climbed onto Lal Hawa. So he had a wish to sit on Lal Hawa. So Lal Hawa stopped at, Ch stopped at Choti Dadi and Kaku went and sat down onto Lal Hawa. And just then, Lal Hawa chuck chucked again. The chuck chuck sound became faster and soon Lal Hawa was flying on magic wheels with Kaku in it. As Kaku went and sat on Lal Hawa, Lal Hawa started moving. It made the chuck chuck sound and started moving. Lal Hawa was flying on magic wheels. You know the train, how it moves, it wheels moves very fast. So Lal Hawa was flying on magic wheels with Kaku in it. Amma smiled. She had tears in her eyes. From a window, Kaku waved to everyone. Lal Hawa was flying and so was Kaku. Now, Amma smiled at Kaku because she was thinking that his dream has come true. Kaku would always think that one day he'll sit on Lal Hawa. Okay, so Kaku sat on Lal Hawa and his Amma smiled and she was very happy. She had tears in her eyes. From the window, Kaku waved to everyone and Lal Hawa was flying and so was Kaku. Then Lal Hawa started and Lal Hawa started moving and Kaku was waving out to everyone in the village. 
So dear children, I hope you enjoyed the story about a little boy and the train. Now, some exercise is given below. Please read the chapter and do the exercise. Thank you and have a nice day.